Well, now, Mr. Iron, what are your plans for the future? Well, I don't know. Um, uh, what? What is that? Um, well, um, I reckon that uh, I'm going to stick around doing what I am for a while and uh, rocking and rolling, you know, and singing all that sort of stuff. And then uh, I like to uh, leave that part of the uh, show business altogether and I like to branch out in the uh, straight side, you know. I like to have... Uh, Go at the old uh, straight at the now, and um, I want to throw off this uh, guitar, you know. I mean, it's walking around with that around your neck all the time. People get sick and tired of that. I mean, you know, you start to get a new gimmick mm -hmm. like the guitar, and uh, all the other fellas flog it to death for you. See, they're all at it now. Yes, I suppose they are. Do you find it's a hindrance, this guitar for you? Well, uh, I wouldn't say it's a hindrance. I mean, you know, I mean, I can't sort of bite the hand that fed me or the uh, fretboard that fed me. <laughs> no, coin a phrase. And no, I, uh, I'm, uh, you know, jolly grateful and all that uh, for uh, what it's done for me. I mean, you know, it's brought me up from nothing to, uh, well, you know, a star, a stage, screen and uh, radio and all that. But, uh, and records, of course. But I reckon that, uh, you know, you know, I think it's played itself out now. So what, what, do you, what do you intend to do? Well, we've been, uh, some friends and I, we've been uh, uh, marking about with uh, some of the classics that the uh, public don't know about. You know, some things have been hid away in the archives for hundreds of years. We came across one the other day. Um, it was uh, the trumpet voluntary. Do you mean the trumpet voluntary by Purcell? Yeah, um, well, yeah, I think that's a fellow. Yeah, that's right, Purcell, yeah. Um, well, take something like that, you see, and uh, get in quick with it in the television, see? Because that's the place to work them sort of songs. You want to get in quick with them, otherwise uh, you breathe a word, you know, around here and cross road, and uh, ten fellas have done it before you got out your front door. <laughs> yes, yes, I suppose they have. And, and what do you intend to do with um, the trumpet voluntary? Well, well, first of all, we're going to uh, do a new arrangement of it completely, get a nice sort of beat going behind it and, uh, well, you know, something for the kids to like, to, uh, you know, do a bit of jive to. Do you hope sell a lot of sell a lot of records? Well, yeah, I've, I mean, I've sold a lot of records as it is anyway. I mean, uh, you know, as, as I was saying, I've come up now to a big star from nothing. I mean, my mother, I bought her an house in Epping Forest, just by the swamp there. And uh, my dad, I got him um, a new 1932 uh, Ford. Well, new, I mean, it's done up, you know, but it looks new now. And uh, oh, with uh, my earnings. I mean, you know, when you uh, like a fella like me, you can't run nothing, and uh, suddenly sh rocket it, rocket it in a stardom. I mean, you know, you've got to sort of keep your feet on the ground, or people go around saying you're a bit of a big headed. Yes, yes. Um, yes, I see. Well, um, I suppose you know that this, uh, this uh, trumpet voluntary Purcell has been uh, attributed to um, Jeremiah Clark. Who? Uh, Jeremiah Clark. Oh, yeah, well, um, no, I didn't know that. As a matter of fact, no. I mean, uh, what do you mean attributed to? It, uh, well, some people say that it was written by Jeremiah Clark. Oh, that, yeah. Well, I mean, I don't know whether he wrote it or not. I mean, I'm not going to stand here and say he did or he didn't. I mean... I mean, it's not my concern, is it? I mean, all I know is out of copyright, you see. That's all that we're bothered about. Yes. Yes, how very uh, true. Well, jolly, jolly good. Perhaps we can hear some of this um, trumpet uh, volunteer. Yes, yes, very, very good, very good. Well, that's not making my go and run now. It's sort of certainly it up, you know, get it going. Yeah. Uh -huh. 
a sock, a come on. Cock a blow, blow the glen cat, a screaming. D plays a last train to ball spawn. Rock, 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 every ball. D rock, grab your doll, have a ball, cut a rock, have a roll. Rock, rock, all you cats and chicks to the trumpet voluntary rock. That's very interesting. Uh, tell me, Mr. Iron, uh, do you have any um, plans for any uh, further records of this nature? Well, yeah. A um, uh, matter of fact, uh, my uh, managers and me are working on uh, Beethoven's Choral Symphony. I reckon, you know, you can do quite a lot with that. And uh, we're doing um, Brunjak's, uh, uh The uh, New World Thing by um, Roger Maradak. And... Um, uh, several other bits, uh, a bit uh, by um, Ravel, and uh, some others. What uh, you know? What are just uh, just out of copyright? I mean, you've got to wait for them to be dead a few years, but uh, then we're going to whip in and uh, have a go at them, as I say. Yes, well, I'm sure that uh, a lot of people will be very pleased to hear that. What try and play that record of yours to Sir Thomas Beecham? I'm sure you'll enjoy it. <laughs> I hope you will. Yeah. Thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs> 